Hi Kai, today we are going to create another useful console app. We are going to make a console app that will extract images from a video file. Let's begin. Open Visual Studio and create a new console application and name it Extract Images from Video. Once the program is created, delete the existing code. Then in Project Properties, set the target OS to be Windows. We are now ready to accomplish our task. Our aim is to take a video file, in this case .mp4 file, and extract the images from the specified time period, and then save each frame as an image to the target folder. To extract our images from the video, we are going to use a third-party library called OpenCV. This is an open-source library that works with video files. We are going to use these two libraries. Here is the code to do this. First we need to add NuGet package references to our project, using the NuGet package manager, like this. Right mouse, button click on the project and select Manage NuGet Packages option from the list. Click on the Browse tab. Search for emgu.cv in the search box. From the Packages list, install emgu.cv and emgu.cv.runtime.windows packages, like so. Now let's walk through the code. First we define few variables. We define the input video file path and the output folder path for extracted frames, like so. We then set the start and end times for frame extraction. Here we are only extracting one second of video frames. Then to the extract frames method we pass the input video file, the target folder, the start and end time, like so. In the extract frames method this is what we are doing. First we wrap our code inside a try-catch block. Try-catch will ensure that any errors are captured and printed to the screen. We then open the video file for reading the frames. We encapsulate this reading inside and using statement. Using statements ensure resources are automatically cleaned up when program crashes. Now we need to check if the video file is successfully opened, if not, we exit this method. We then initialize variables for frame number and frame rate and create an OpenCV mat object to hold each frame. Now all we have to do is loop through the frames in the video, like so. First, we get the frame timestamp in seconds. On the first frame, we calculate the frame rate. Now we can save the frame as an image, like so. Then we increment the frame number. And finally we check if the specified end time is reached, if so end the extraction and the loop. We then print the path of the saved frame to the console, and finally print a message when extraction is complete. Now we are ready to run the application. But before we do that, Let's check the video file that we want to extract the images from. And here it is. So when we run the application, we should have some images from this video file. Now let's run the program. Now check in the output folder that the images has been extracted. And here we have the extracted images. That's it. We have now made a console app that will extract images from a video file. Simple, wasn't it? The complete code is available in the description. You can copy-paste it into your project.